Alright, this is a quick video on how to save your blobs on a uh, non-jailbroken device on Windows 10. So, first things first, you got to make sure you have iTunes installed. So go to the Microsoft Store, within iTunes, and just install this one here. Once that's installed, let's just launch iTunes, and you want to plug in your phone. USB, let's not do that, and then it'll come up uh, asking you to authorize the device, something like that, check in your password on your phone, click trust, whatever, it should then connect up here and you'll be able to see your device. Now that we've done that, let's type in here, we'll go to Google Blob Saver, this one here, S squared dash Blob Saver on GitHub, let's have a look, I've got a button here for download here. You see it requires Java, but we'll worry about that in a sec. First of all, um, download the relevant one here, Windows 10. Windows download there. Download that. Um, go ahead and try and install it. it. might tell you you need Java. For me, uh, if that's the case, you want to install this one here. Uh, the Windows Offline Java. If you're on a 64-bit operating system, obviously you want to run that one there. Install that. Once you've done so, you'll be able to pull up blob saver looks like this um, click these buttons here read from device it'll bip in your ECID and then you also want to bip in I think on the A12 and later chips um, like the XR and the XS and the SE2020 and such you want to read the app nonce as well read from device once you've put in the ECID um, choose a preset to save it into um, or save a preset rather and then yeah hit go and it'll save it to uh, this directory here and then you have your blob save what are blobs um, no one actually knows it's just a made-up thing that as they were developing the iPhone they kind of ended up with these blob files uh, on their computer and they just figured it was an important part of the doc the uh, development somewhere and just kept them around um, but yeah no one has uh, any idea what they do um, but they're important we think for uh, downgrading devices and such so yeah, apparently it's a good thing to do, to back them up. Anyhow, that's uh, that's how to get it done on a non-jailbroken phone uh, on Windows 10.